dear children cheerful greetings now we can move to the next chapter that's a poem chapter number 8 what if what is the name of the chapter what if written by shell silverstein shell silverstein he was born on 1930 and lived up to 1999 he was an american poet songwriter as well as cartoonist singer and author of children's books his major works include here we are talking about some of his major works where the sidewalk ends that is one of his work the giving tree that is another work a boy named sue that is another work here three main works has been mentioned he also he was also the recipient of two grammy awards he was also awarded with two grammy awards okay the award named grammy was given to him now let me say you something about the poem this poem what if is written with a child in focus it is just focusing on a child the child in the poem worries about various things thinking so the child is simply thinking of various things what if personification is used to show the what ifs as small creatures that plant ideas inside the child's head okay what is personification it's a figure of speech personification represents an abstract quality in a human form okay abstract quality in a human form when we represent that is called as personification taking the form of a person that is called as personification okay as what if as small creatures small creatures that plant ideas inside the child's mind okay as plant is just uh, just is planting new ideas inside the child's mind okay new new ideas has been given to the child that there may be such a possibility there may be this possibility likewise giving more more ideas more more thinkings towards the child's mind that's only he is here said about the poem the poem has been written from a child's point of view okay here we have to think in the point of view of a child it deals with a fears doubt insecurity that happens with a child okay that uh, happening or going throughout the mind of the child in the poem the child worries that what things are not the way he wants them to be what are the things that are not the way he wants them to be now can we move to the poem okay last night when i lay thinking here who's i speak her the child lay thinking here some what ifs what ifs means possibilities crowd inside my ear crowd inside my ear crowd means came came inside my ear just ringing going on ringing some possibilities and pranced and partied all night long and pranced pranced means moved quickly partied all night moved very quickly and that same thought or same possibility was going on ringing in my ears inside my ears whose ears speaker who assumed to be a child and sang their same old what if song that same old possibility songs or what if songs was going on ringing in the speaker's mind so now let's see what are those possibilities or what are those what if songs okay the first question is what if i am dumb in school dumb dumb means unable to speak dumb means unable to speak if i am dumb in school what happens to my life 
Okay, first what if question or first possibility thinking possibility. What if they have closed the swimming pool? If they have closed the swimming pool, what will happen to me? Next question. What if I get beat up? So if I get beat or pushed up, what will happen in my life? What if there's poison in my cup? What will happen if there is poison in my cup? Cup of tea or cup of water, whatever it is, what will happen? What if I start to cry? What will happen if I start to cry? What if I get sick and die? What will happen if I get sick and I die off? I am completely vanished from the earth. I am not at all seen in the earth. What if I flunk that rest? Flunk means fail. What if I flunk that test? If I fail in the test or exam, what will happen? What if green hair grows on my chest? If green hair start growing on my chest, what will happen? All these what if questions is simply going on ringing in my mind. That the, the speaker is assuming himself to be a child. And so many questions are just going on rotating in his head. Again, there are a few more questions. Let's see that. Again, the speaker is having some more what if questions just ringing in his mind. So, we'll see what are they. What if nobody likes me? If no one likes me, what will happen to me? What if a bolt of lightning strikes me? Bolt means sudden strike. If the lightning sudden suddenly strike on me or hit on my head, what will happen? What if I don't grow taller? Always if I am short, if I don't grow tall, what will happen to me? What if my head starts getting smaller? My head, which contain of brain and all those things, if it gets smaller, what will happen? What if the fish won't bite? Here, fish won't bite means, what will happen if I fail to catch the fish? If I fail to catch the fish, if I don't get a chance to catch the fish, what will happen? What if the wind tears up my kite? The wind is just tearing off my kite. What is going to happen? I don't have a kite then. What if they start a war? If there is a quarrel either among my parents or in the street, I have to see that. What is it? It is a pathetic condition. What if my parents get divorced? If my parents are separated, divorced, what is going to happen? Then I can't be with my parents. What if the bus is late? What will happen if the bus is late? I can't go to school on time. Then I may be late. What if my teeth don't grow in straight? If my teeth is not growing in a straight way, if it is curved, what will happen? I may look sometimes ugly. What if I tear my pants? If my pants are torn, what is going to happen? I don't get again pants to wear. What if I never learn to dance? If I don't know to dance or if I never learn to dance, what is going to happen? I can't shine in front of others. Everything seems swell and then. Swell means first rate or stylish. So here all these thoughts or all these questions just arising at the first rate. All are what if, what if questions. So many questions have been ringing in my head. These are the things if happened happens in my life. What will happen to my life? The night time. What if strikes again? That means this possibility questions. Night. The speaker is about to lie down and sleep. Going on ringing in the mind. However, these what if questions keep on troubling me again and again. So, as a small child, there is a chance of getting so many possible questions. 
or possibilities of arising questions that is going on ringing in our mind. So simply let's not raise such type of unnecessary questions within our minds and get ourselves confused. Now we can learn the new words and their meanings for the poem. What if? Bold. Bold means flash of lightning in sky appearing as a line. Flash of lightning in sky appearing as a line. Next one, crowd. Crowd means came or appear in. Came or appeared in. Appeared in mind. Crowd means came or appeared in mind. Next one, dumb. Dumb means unable to speak. Dumb, unable to speak. Next one, flunk. Fail in a test. Flunk means fail in a test or an exam. Next one, pranced. Moved with quick and exaggerated steps. Pranced means moved with quick and exaggerated steps. Next one, swell, stylish or first rate. Swell means stylish or first rate. Children, I hope the poem is clear. Read the poem several times and work out the exercises which is given in the textbook. See you in the next class.